Now to continuing coverage of a major project happening right now at the oceanfront. As we've reported, Virginia Beach teamed up with the Norfolk District of Army Corps of Engineers for a $22 million beach renourishment project. Yeah, it comes right as hurricane and tourist season gets underway. Ten on your sides, Kara Dixon is here now with what changes may happen and how new technology will keep residents up to date. Kara. Stephanie, Laura, this beach replenishment project is the second one that's been done at the oceanfront since 2013. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers says that it's learned from that project and believe this one can not only help save multiple infrastructures, but also money. The beach at the oceanfront is expanding. The wider the beach, the more protection that provides behind it. So all the relaxing and fun had here can continue for years to come. Tomorrow, crews will start pumping sand from under the water to its new home under the sun. It's part of a beach renourishment project led by the U.S. Army Corps in Norfolk. That's where we spoke with the project manager, Kristen Mazur. It actually uh, prevented over 500 and, uh, 550 million dollars in damage at Virginia Beach and Sandbridge. Saving 550 million through this $22 million project by reinforcing the beach against Mother Nature. It's the second time they've replenished in six years. Mazur says they learned a lot since 2013, specifically seeing that most of their efforts will go toward the pier area. Winds, storms that impact the beach, and then the way that the particular the sand is, is shoaled offshore. So that means the area 60th Street and above won't get as much sand, but visitors and businesses will still see sections of the beach closed. There should be no more than 48 hours of impact in front of each hotel. And a new feature this year, you can follow the progress with an online interactive map. Mazur says this will help provide accountability for all the dollars spent. And we're updating that at least every two days to show people where we're constructing. The red sections will be in construction, orange sections are to be constructed, and the green sections have already been constructed. Building now with plans for the future in mind to help those along the ocean front be prepared when Mother Nature hits. And the Army Corps says another replenishment project will be underway in Sandbridge near the end of the year. Engineers will also use that interactive map for that as well. Mazur also told me that a turtle nest was found near 60th Street, and they will not do any type of pumping near there. I'm Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.